this is a video series, uh, a video on uh, superheroes by John Bevere uh, from his book Extraordinary. Um, the uh, Truth to Go series by Hundred Huntley uh, on YouTube have made a series of 1 to 15 where John Bevere did a series called the Truth to Go series at that uh, website address and this is the second um, uh, se second title in that uh, performance uh, so it's called Superheroes by John Bevere John starts out with a scripture that we all know as the Christian church and we've all heard before it says I has not seen nor ear heard neither has entered into the heart of man the things that God has prepared for him. Uh, John says that many people know that verse and that they assume that that verse is about heaven and times to come and things to come in heaven. Um, not many of them believe that that's a verse for here and now. That's a verse for earth. That's a verse for us to take hold of the kingdom on earth and do things that have not been seen, have not been heard or entered into the heart of man. And that's something that you cannot believe has happened. That's doing something that people cannot believe it's happened. They cannot believe it when they see it. They cannot believe it when they hear it. Uh, it would have never entered into the hearts of men that their friend would rise to such a glorious uh, place where he's risen to. So, uh, taking it further, is th that me, for instance, uh, in the future, in 10 years' time, might become an international speaker who speaks in conferences all around the world with millions of people uh, tuning into YouTube and listening to what I've got to say. Who, who would say that I could do something extraordinary like this. This is the sort of thing that Jesus is talking about in this scripture. The scripture goes on uh, and John says that people don't often see the, the next part of the scripture. It says, I has not seen nor ye heard nor neither has entered into the heart of man the things that have been prepared for him, but God has revealed them to us by his spirit revealed them to us by his spirit when now god can reveal the things that can't be seen nor the ear believe or enter into the heart but through his spirit he can reveal those things to us on earth and see us accomplish those things do you get it this is a video series that john bevere is talking about his book extraordinary uh uh, someone who recommends books to me from time to time is my mother and sometimes when a book powerfully affects her she makes a summary of a book and she's made a summary of John Bevere's book and it's taken hours and hours to complete the summary. She says it's one of the most powerful books she's ever read. God wants us to live an extraordinary life. Do you know that? Do you know I was at uh, a church this morning, uh, visiting a church, Hillsong Church in Australia. There was an Indian girl in front of me and the Lord put on my heart that he wanted me to speak to her. And when it comes to meet and greet time in the service, I said to her, I said, you know, we all have spiritual gifts, but God has told me to tell you, you've got the gift of an intercessor. You're, you're very gifted in prayer and God wants you to pray and intercede for other people and the nations. And she was very blessed. And later on in the service, after a couple of songs, the Lord told me to tell her that uh, the Lord can do way above her dreams. That you've got some very big dreams and you, you don't know how you'll even achieve them. They're so big. But God wants you to know that you're dreaming little, that he's going to do a lot more than you can even dream or conceive. She, after the service, she, she turned around to me and gave me a block of chocolate 
and said, I want you to receive that as a gift. I've been through a really troublesome and hard time of late, and I really, really needed to hear what you had to say. It was funny because I came into the church service late and they were doing uh, emergency chairs and they seated us right to one side of the church in these emergency chairs. And here she was in the building right in front of me. If I came in at the normal time of the service, 20 minutes before the service, she wouldn't have been seated in front of me. God had the timing right. He wants to do extraordinary things through us. Uh, an extraordinary life is a life that's not normal, it's a life that's not average, and it's a life that's not ordinary, it's extraordinary. Uh, um, John Bevere shares uh, that uh, 19 out of 25 of the biggest blockbuster movies of all time uh, involve characters who had superpowers or had uh, some sort of super life over adversity. Uh, such uh, films as Superman and Spider-Man and Indiana Jones and Batman, these are all movies that are blockbusters uh, that take big office uh, earnings. And why? It's because people like to see someone doing extraordinary things. I know um, one uh, movie that that was uh, an overcoming sort of movie was Titanic and, and that, that was a, a very emotional movie but uh, the one that beat it was uh, this Avatar and that was uh, people with extraordinary powers and extraordinary resilience. People like to see extraordinary things happen and uh, John Bevere um, says that we're created for that um, he says in his video that um, Adam named one million animals uh, that lived on the face of the earth. He named them all and he had a memory to remember the one million names. Can you remember a million names? That's what our potential of our mind was created with. And some will say that we all lost that with the curse of, of, of sin and we lost that ability of our mind but Jesus came to break down the curse and restore the curse. Uh, the, the, the apostles of the faith, John says in this video, were, were uh, looked upon as superheroes. Uh, Peter had to tell a Roman centurion not to bow down and worship him. And Paul mentioned more than twice in scripture, had to remind people that he wasn't a god and tell them that I'm just an ordinary man. Uh, remember uh, an, uh, an angel slash uh, prophet of God showed uh, uh, John through the book of Revelation and the angel bowed to him twice and John said I'm just a man just uh, bow to me bow to Jesus they were superheroes of the faith and they were accounted to be extraordinary sort of people uh, you can do extraordinary things uh, one extraordinary thing you can do is go and have a look at the series uh, that uh, John Bevere has done on, on the 100 Huntley channel, uh, Truth To Go. If you type in Truth To Go, John Bevere, have a look at the whole series and do yourself a favour. Just don't look at what I've got to say, look at the master.